This is the Snow Coach 685. I picked it up on Craigslist earlier this fall. Uh, I just pull it with my ZR600. I made a little bit of modifications to it. This is an older one. It actually had the steel skis on it. And there's a local guy here that has a snowmobile salvage yard. So I retrofitted some 3 inch Articat spindles on there on the existing suspension. The old steel skis were three and a half, so I actually shaved down these bushings on there. I revamped the suspension as well. The <clears throat> existing suspension that was on it had two solid, almost uh, springs in there that very had very little give at all on both sides. So I removed them. I made a new bracket, almost looks like OEM, um, and welded on some tabs for the coilover shocks. I pulled off of a Kawasaki motorcycle out of a salvage yard, put LED taillight bulb in there, They're a little brighter. Um, I actually hooked it up to the snowmobile as well. The tail light is identical to the tail light on this one, and it's running off the AC power. Um, inside, I did a Gerbing's outdoor heated pad. It's actually a blind pad, and I actually have a barrel jack coming up from underneath. So when you sit in here, you're not freezing your butt off. The kids aren't. And this Gerbing's pad takes seven and a half volts and it's in DC, in which the sled is in AC. So I had to buy these static output converters, which convert AC to DC power, which basically is a bridge rectifier. Um, and then powered this 12 volt to 7.5 volt step down regulator for that heating pad and I also added a switch for the heat of the seat and then a button for the kids to let me know on the snowmobile that they would like to stop if I'm driving on the trail. The dome light I added as well which is powered off that same 12 volt converter so they can see at night if they want to look at something or keep the light on if they're scared. Um, pretty happy with how it turned out. Had to add a hitch to the ZR, which wasn't a big deal. Found an old stock um, hitch online. And uh, what else did I do? Converted the Converted the ZR to LED headlights with some of those same 12 volt output converters. So all three light bulbs are LED and along with the instrument cluster are LED as well. Um, had to replace the stator in the Articat and the track was going to hell so I put an inch and a, inch and a quarter camso track on it as well. Uh, it's a 98 ZR, so it's it was getting up there in age, 20, almost 22 years old. So uh, this is a setup for the kids, and they like it a lot. Cruising down the trail, go to a lot of different bars and stop, and we live right on a trail here, so you can hop right on and take off. I'll probably make some videos of the snow coach in action. Uh, inside the snow coach as well and I'll maybe mount the GoPro to the back of the snowmobile as well so you can see it going down the trail. Um,
suspension is fairly soft. I rode in it myself. If you look at it, it's got very nice uh, soft plush ride, so it's not so dang rough like the old one was. Um, I gotta still figure out something for the safety chain to hook up to here. I just don't want a steel hook on the plastic. Maybe some sort of um, strap I'll figure out with that. Uh, basically dis disassembled the whole frame as well in the snow coach, painted it, and put all stainless hardware on it so nothing will rust. So yeah, that's the, the snow coach. Uh, they're kind of hard to find. I looked around for about two and a half years trying to find this one and luckily a guy near the Twin Cities had one so I went and picked it up from him. Thanks for watching.